Hi everyone, we are Il Volo and this is Yahoo. We love Christmas music, the Christmas favorites. We recorded an EP of four songs two years ago, and uh, but we decided to, to record an entire album with all the Christmas American favorites. We, we love Christmas. We can't wait to go back home, to spend time with our family. And, and we thought about it and they say, why we should sing Christmas songs so we can enjoy our music during the Christmas season, you know what I mean? With our family, listening to our Christmas songs. So that's beautiful. That's why we decided to, to record it. I think Holy Night was the first song that we picked, you know? Because it's a classical song. And uh, I, personally, I first heard that song from Celine Dion version, and then Pavarotti. And I, I was like in shock the first time that I heard that song because it's, it's, it's a huge song. It's, it's, it's a beautiful song and then we were talking about the album and we decide we gotta sing that song we have to sing that song il volo buon natale and we decide to put an italian title because we are italian and so in our album we don't have like italian songs but we decide to put like american songs but we have panis angelicus and ave maria and so our goal is to bring our music all around the world but Every, everyone knows that the most famous e Christmas songs are the American ones, so we had to record that. And then we decided, but the title must be in Italian. And so, Il Volo Buon Natale. Santa Claus is coming. You know, uh, to town. town. Yes, to town. You know, it's a beautiful song, happy song, right? And you know, we decided to do some, the, the song, but no, he sees you when you see, because we have a producer, which is, is Latin, is Latin, from Chile. And so we decided to do something more different, you know? Uh, put something Latin also, and then mix it with the American music. And he came out really good, because he's so funny. Because you sing, not the simple, not the, the, the regular Santa Claus is coming, they used to with the samba. And the people, most of the time they say you sing opera. We don't sing opera because we can't. But our kind of music is operatic pop. And what is it, operatic pop? It's the same music, it's the same kind of music of Andrea Bocelli, Josh Groban, El Divo. And what we do is we sing the classical Italian songs like O Sole Mio, Namore Così Grande, and uh, we sing to the pop songs. And in our new album, El Volo, in our second album, El Volo, We Are Love, we have Beautiful Day from U2 and I Don't Wanna Miss a Thing from Iron Smith. But we don't think this song has U2 and Iron Smith did it. So we want to bring the pop songs in our world and we sing the pop songs in a classical way and the classical, really classical songs in a fresh in Latin America, we have um, uh, teenagers, fans, like screaming fans, waiting for us uh, outside the airports, hotels. So that's crazy. Morning. Probably because it's a different culture, you know what I mean? Because uh, there are more, how can I say, um, warm, you know, in Latin America. In the United States, there are more adults, but that's okay, understand, because probably there are uh, a lot of Italian, you know, people from, you know, the region from Italy and um, American, uh, American people love operatic pop, love opera. Andrea Bocelli is the one who, dis who sing for the first time uh, this kind of music. But we are happy about it, you know, we are still young. We, we, <laughs> so we have all the time, you know, to, to, that's what we are doing, to bring, Italian melody, Italian music, bel canto italiano, that's the name of it, to the world. That's what we want to Yeah, you know, it's, we have an adult audience, you know, and they love us, but, you know, we are young, we are, we are focused on the work. I got fever in Asia when we were in promotional tour in Asia, and so I started losing weight, and I like it. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I think I just started eating better and gym workout and i i think i have to say thanks also to them they always i never give up and they always believe in me you know like come on you can the english songs are really hard for us because you know um we have not a perfect pronunciation but we try we work hard to the studio to make the best 
to do the best for for the for the best pronunciation, you know. And so I think all the song was particularly hard, but you know, with the with the help of the record company, because they help us, someone from the label Bree help had us. us. Bree had me Bree with me whole holy night. Yeah. You know, sweet hymns of Jane great of ingrateful chorus. Chorus. Right? Chorus you know, Ray Sweet. And, so and she has a she has a beautiful chorus. voice. And they really helped us a lot. A lot. Yeah. I remember when, when I first sang, was in my room because I was born in the north of Italy, so I was alone with my family because all, um, with my parents, because all my family is from the south of Italy. And so I was alone in my room <clears throat> singing La Donna Mobile. And my mother was like in the other room, what's going on here? Who is singing? So my mother found me in my room singing La Donna Mobile. What are you doing, Ignacio? Nothing, mommy, I'm just singing La Donna Mobile. What? <laughs> This kind of music is so young, you know. And I start, and and then when I moved to Sicily, to the south, I started doing like this, this region competition, you know. And all the people was like shocked, listening, you know, the, the little man, the little boy singing like, oh, it's 45 years old, man. Yeah. I started singing with my with my grandpa when I was three or four years old. I can say that he's my inspiration, and I started to listen to uh, Andrea Bocelli. I uh, used to s sing uh, the Andrea Bocelli songs. But, you know, uh, last year I discovered a new kind of music, and new, new singers like Frank Sinatra, Dean Martin, Perry Como, Andy Williams, because I'm a baritone. They are two tenors. So I like opera. But my favorite kind of music right now is Frank. My grandpa, Frank. my grandpa discovered my voice when I was like five, six, six years old, and he's blind, and he was like recording a song, and I started to, to to sing with him, and it was like a joke singing with him, and then the joke became passion. And then I record like a little little CD, and my dad was so proud of me, you know, let the people listening my voice, and from then all the people like shocked, as Ignacio said, from 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 the first time that they hear this seven eight years old guy singing like 45 years old, and then from there we we were like so lucky because we met in the same moment, in the same, same year, in the same place, at the same moment, and uh, I think that. And uh, I think that we are special together. It's something, you know, um, because when we sing together, I always say that we have three voices, but just one soul. Because we have three different voices, completely different voices. I'm a baritone, they are two tenors. His voice is very powerful, powerful, you know, and uh, he can reach high, high notes. It's unbelievable. And I can sing with, you know, deep notes, loud, low, uh, low notes, no? And I always start the songs and then, uh, you know, like, O Sole Mio. So that's special. You know? you know, we sing alone, you know, the, but when I sing my part, when he sings his part, and when he sings to his part alone, you know, we have different feelings. But when we sing together, we feel like the same thing. It's strange to explain, but we f it's, it's like we feel the same thing, you know? It's just the one same motion. Side, it's just, just one voice. voice. Yes, yeah. and we try to express this, these feelings through the voice, through the music. Sweet hymns of joy In grateful chorus raise we With all within A new and glorious morn Christ is the Lord His name Oh, night divine.
Listen and children, listen to hear sleigh bells in the snow. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas with every Christmas card I write. Out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm, I'm telling you why. Santa, Santa Claus is coming to town. 